Shalom friends, welcome to Daf Reactions Chagiga 4. In this Daf, we're going to check in with our best bud, the Angel of Death, and find out what's going on in his world of crazy workplace drama. The question is, are there cases where people die before their time for no reason? The Gemara regales us with the story of Rav Bevai Bar Abaye, who was at that time hanging out with the Angel of Death. So the Angel of Death had his personal assistant, who for the purpose of this video, we will name Chad. The Angel of Death turned to Chad and said, Chad, can you bring me uh, Miriam, the braider of hair? It's um, her time to go. Instead of the right Miriam, he went out and got Miriam, the one who raises babies. Now the Angel of Death was like, I hate my job, I hate my job. Chad, this is the wrong Miriam. We've talked about this. I hired you to make my job less stressful. And Chad was like, okay, wow, first of all, toxic work environment. And second of all, if it's that huge of an issue, bring her back to life again. The angel of death said to Chad, fine, never mind, since you've already brought her here, let's just have her stay dead. Now this whole time, Rav Bavai was just sitting there like, what? And he said, are you telling me that you're actually authorized to take people before their actual time? And the angel of death was like, Okay, fine. I get around this bureaucratic nightmare by sort of driving their souls around the parking lot until it's their real time to go. And then I pass them on to the Angel Duma, who's the manager of the souls of the dead. And I just like take those extra years and, and donate them to a Torah scholar. At this point, I would like to take this opportunity to address uh, the Angel of Death, Chad, and any other inept minions he currently employs on behalf of myself and my fellow Miriams. Um, we are not all the same. Please check very carefully before you take us away and kill us. Thank you. Hashtag not all Miriam's Chad.